Hello everybody, and welcome back to my channel. Well, today is March 11th. I forgot to put that in the other video, but yeah, those rims really kicked my butt. Yeah. So, you can do it if you have health problems, but you'll probably regret it. But it can be done. So. Yeah, I thought it would be easier using these. But nope. These things are extremely heavy. And I shouldn't even be lifting them. So. This one goes back in its place. I'll be selling those sometime. Don't know when. And then this one will go back in its place. I got them all, you know, scattered around. I think I got another one of those, but I'm not sure. But there's those three. All I got to do is take the lead off of it and the stems. I found a new way of doing the stems since that tool that I bought was a piece of crap. I'll still use it because of the valve stem remover. But the hell is that? Some big semi truck just appeared. Okay, so this is the last one that I got to put in there. Yeah, so I, I hope you guys enjoyed me struggling to get that off. When I start to actually make money, I won't even bother with it anymore. I'll just have the tire shop just take them off. Come, come on. Was it that difficult? <laughs> so. Those are the pieces I took off. I can just throw those in the dumpster. Uh, because. From what I hear. There's a myth. Saying that. They don't want to put them in the landfill. Because. Over time. Uh, it fills up with air and then comes uh, back up to the surface. I have never heard of that. So, I don't know if that's true or not or if that's a bunch of BS. Most likely it's probably a bunch of BS. But, yeah. So, that is done. But I wanted to come here and put those rims back in the unit because I have to start getting things together for the scrapyard. What I'm going to take, I don't know. I was kind of hoping to have that radiator today, but I haven't heard from him. He was supposed to call me yesterday at 5 o'clock, but 
I never did. Oh, I can't leave that. <coughs> That's Scrapper's Gold right there. Scrapper's Gold. So, I'll just put it in that bucket right there. So, I think what I'm going to put in that bucket is the aluminum that's already been done. It'll weigh it down fast. Uh, or no, that's not what I'm going to put in there. I'm going to put those windings in that bucket. And in that black bucket, I'm going to put the copper windings in it. Because I need to start getting that going. In fact, those will probably be my next video. As soon as I can get back in there again. I'll grab some motors and... Ones that I've already taken. Not like the ones that are in front right there. Ones that have already been taken out of the metal casing. Because I still have a lot of those to do. But. Yeah. So I figure I give you this small little update. That the tires are done. And then I can get back to cleaning this. Now that I don't have anything in my way. But. I need more buckets. That's what I need. More buckets. Today is Monday, so... I don't know if he'll be there, but... I usually get my buckets from the Chinese restaurant because they buy buckets of soy sauce. Uh, that's what those two buckets are right there. Two buckets of soy sauce. I just he washes them out for me and and just gives them to me. So, but yeah. So I'm going to go ahead and end this one, so I will see you in the next one. Hopefully it'll be a scrapping video. Until then, uh, scrap it, scrap it right, make that money. Peace. About time that fucker turned that semi off. Okay. Oh, by the way, yes, there is a lot of cussing on this channel. Sorry, but that's the way I am. <laughs> see you guys later.